It's Bronwyn from Rap, and today I just want to give you a couple of quick tips on how to get some personality out of a groove that is um, just a back groove in your mix, but you want to give it a little bit of um, warmth and body and get it to sit nicely in the mix. So let's have a listen. I've got a groove here, and uh, let's play it. Yeah, it's a nice groove, but I just want a little bit more personality. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert uh, channel EQ. And uh, as the groove is playing, I'm going to watch my spectrum analyzer. And I really want to boost its uh, sort of low end and uh, particularly find that fundamental and just give it a nice lift and warm up that um, lower mid range as well. I know that that sounds a bit strange because it's uh, not often we want to warm up um, and enhance those lower mid range frequencies. Sometimes we want to clean them up. But in this instance, I really just want to create some personality in this particular groove. And I also am going to use a shelf and just clean off um, some of that bottom end, I don't need anything really from 40 hertz and below. So I'm just going to shelve that off. Let's have a listen to this groove. Yep, around about 80 hertz. Yep, and I've waxed it up quite nicely and then around about 200. And that EQ has just really helped that drum groove come alive and give it a bit of personality. In addition, I've added a compressor for uh, some more dynamic level control as well as to dial in some extra character and personality as well. There's more information on compressors and types of compressors and how you can use them. Please go and visit raponline.net for our quick dial series. And... Um, then what I've done just to really make this groove sparkle is I've added in an effect and I've sent um, this particular groove through into a nice space uh, just to give it a bit of life. Right, so I'm going to switch off all my parameters and then slowly as the track is playing, I'll introduce each. Here we go. Well, there you have it. I'll catch you again next time.